we're going to have a very spirited election this uh, this November, and uh, by all accounts, no matter how the outcome is, that next January could be the mother of all lame duck sessions uh, regarding tax policies and every other we want to call hot button issue, which uh, the legislature or the majority party wants to place before the legislature during the spring session. So uh, we think it's important that uh, the public is uh, made aware of this, but more importantly, legislators need to be held accountable during this period. They have absolutely no accountability during that week of January, a number of people who are on their way out. Uh, and even as the last time we had, we went through this, there were people who were brought in for three days, three days only to serve uh, as a state representative, uh, just there to take the tax vote and the other issues which came up during that time, with absolutely no way for constituents to find out who they were, how to reach how to reach out to them, how to find them, to talk about what their thoughts were about that, uh, that process. And I will tell you, everyone in this room, at some point or another during a career, after a lame duck session has occurred where there's been this type of activity, they ask, how the heck did you guys allow this to happen? Why did this happen? This is insane. It's nuts. And that's what we're trying to do. We want to be able to put this to the voters. We want them to be able to, uh, we want to put this on the ballot and, uh, you know, make sure that this is something that our voters will be able to uh, control. Uh, I would say that most people, if they were aware of how this process works, they would be disgusted by this process. We have problems enough as it is, uh, as elected officials, with our confidence uh, that we have throughout the state of Illinois with our constituents. We're trying to restore that in every angle, every possible way we can. 